Hi, this is Steven from SGV. Okay, so today I'm gonna explain about the uh, threshold picking from Blue Yonder WMS. Okay, so we have uh, the inventory, uh, the two pallet, right, which is the full pallet of 84 each. Okay, 84 each for a uh, full pallet. Okay, and then we have the order, only asking less than a full pallet but it's almost to the full pallet right so uh, it's a 72 okay so uh, let's uh, look at the threshold uh, configuration so 84 is a full pallet okay and uh, you can see the threshold percentage uh, put it as a uh, 80 percent right so 80 percent uh, from uh, 72 is the quantities uh, 68 to 70 to 83 is considered to be a threshold picking right so 72 is uh, is to be considered as a threshold picking either as a threshold picking all right so now we create a wave uh, just to uh, do the allocation So there is a uh, disorder. Let's uh, create a wave, right? And then I put in the order number. Then I search the order there to be to be wave. Okay, I put in the wave number. W so picking zero one. Okay, then create the wave for that order. Okay, so wave is created and uh, allocate allocate the wave for the order, and then uh, after that. Uh, press OK. Okay, let's wait. So, uh, during allocation, it will decide uh, whether to consider a uh, threshold picking or not, right? So now, uh, after we allocate, so this is uh, the picking, right? So the it's trying to pick the threshold picking, uh, and is allocating the pallet UOM right it's actually one pallet is trying to do the picking but uh, the picking is only uh, 72 72 yeah which is uh, less than a full pallet of uh, 84 but it's uh, gonna pick uh, one full pallet of 84 okay so let's uh, do the mobile and to uh, doing the uh, threshold picking or, or uh, RF uh, directed picking right so first is the location yeah the location will appear pick up the product at this location go to the location and then next then uh enter the uh pilot id or lpn right so the lpn name is search first so this is the uh, lpn that i'm gonna take Okay, for the uh for the same location go to lpn right so we choose one of it okay it's one pallet you can see the quantity is one pallet yeah it's one pallet it's uh, basically it's 84 okay the um is pallet one pallet is 84 uh even though the order is asking for 72 but uh, we actually picking a it a uh, pallet which is a uh, 84 so it's automatically threshold uh it's called a threshold split right so it's it's trying to uh after you take one pallet it's trying to split the split uh, pallet right uh to be uh of a uh, 12 right so 72 uh is the one is required for the picking and then uh 12 uh k 
case for the pallet, right, is the one that not required, right? Not required. So that's why we have to uh, split and we have to put in the uh, pallet ID again for the split, right? We confirm the split uh, pallet, uh, split pallet for only the unwanted uh, for picking, which is the 12, right? So we put in 12 for the, uh, the split pallet, the one that unwanted, right? unwanted for picking right so if it's unwanted for picking so we have to put it back to the location so the system will, will uh, look at the put away uh, uh, storage search path right then the system will, will suggest the put away location which is the location of the uh, case pick face right so it was from uh, uh, a pallet and then the unwanted uh, put it uh, back to the uh, case uh, pick location right this is the key. then after that uh, after you put the unwanted one so the next one is to deposit or to to move from the the wanted one the 72 to the uh, shipping staging or urban staging right so this is the the one uh, 72 is the one for the picking So seventy two is already done. So uh, uh, so the picking the threshold is already done, right? So let's see, uh, the uh, uh, we call it inventory, right? So the inventory is like it was like this, right? And then we refresh. When we refresh, you see the uh, pick quantity seventy two is in the outbound staging and then the split pallet uh, of 12 is in the pick uh, case pick location right so this is uh, about the uh, threshold picking thank you